And now I've caused a bit of a traffic jam. <sighs> Hi everyone, I'm Jay. Good to see you again. Welcome to season two. And to kick things off, we will go back to the touring cars this week at VIR. A very difficult free track, but if you can master this, then the I rating will come flooding in, I promise you that. With a new bop of the touring cars as well, quick spoiler, the bop's good. I've really been enjoying some of the battles I've been having in the practice and in the races so far this season, and I think quite a few other people have as well, especially in the touring car discord, which you can check the links underneath, you'll find plenty of those in there. Now, this split twice, I got home a little bit earlier, and usually the session that I pick doesn't split at all or if it does it's very slight so we get like 10 11 cars per race but this was a good healthy two split race this early in the week this early in the day and that's a really really good sign for this series something that uh had a lot of hype on it at red um, on reddit and other various social medias that i rate and were putting up if it had a touring car in the hype was starting to grow and with the addition of the clio as well if you're driving the clio so they're getting more of these as well they will complement each other pretty well i would say in my own personal opinion we're in top split it is a strength of field of just under 2.5k this is our first official race since getting 3k for the first time you can see that race uh in some of my previous postings but uh yeah you're gonna see the full qualifying lap the full race with all the instants meshed together so check all of those out Thumbs up the video, subscribe, and comment underneath what you're going to be racing this season. I'll uh, see you afterwards for my final thoughts. Just giving Kevin, don't worry, I'm not crazy. 15 minutes, you've not got much time to sort this out. The track temp is 27, the air temp is 25 Celsius. Okay Jay, let's get this right, no fuck ups. Green, green, green. 15 minutes left, that's 15 Ooh. minutes. Thought Rob had a really good start there, but... Well, he pulled off really quick. On your right. Hold your line. Hold your line. Clear right. Let's keep it nice and steady. 
feel like we're going to get pushed quite quickly though. Why would you do that? First, second lap, flap, corner drama. Hate to see it. First of all though, good to see such great participation, two splits already. I've come home a little bit earlier where it does get a little bit quieter and to already be in two splits this early is brilliant, love it. Love to see it. So thank you to everyone who's new to TCR or thinking about doing TCR, the hype has worked and hopefully get to see you over the next few weeks. Meanwhile, point eight behind Robert. Robert uh, Matthias or Matthias, sorry I keep getting your name wrong, don't scold me. Regulars in the videos last season. It's good to see them back as well. Hey Roland, you're blinking a lot. Try and keep up if I can, 1.2. Got a hope I had a slightly better exit out of there than Richard, but he is closer and within slipstream distance, about 1.2 seconds ish. Just calm yourself down. Via difficult track, very difficult track, but it is free, so get yourselves on there and get practicing because boy, will you need it. Very easy to make stupid mistakes like that and lose far too much time. And now I've caused a bit of a traffic jam. <sighs> I tried to keep myself to the side. Richard backed out, luckily for me. That has put the pack a little bit close together now. It's okay. We will not lose our heads. Less than a half a second I'm losing my head. The slipstreams I've heard in the Touring Car Discord, which you can find the link underneath the video haven't been as strong apparently and by the looks of it they're not still hasn't gained that much to be honest so hopefully that'll uh, be good for us as we try and uh, defend as much as we can still a few corners I'm not completely confident at Point three, and we've got Emilio behind as well. The leader has just done one fifty-eight point six six. You four. Hug. Play right. That's it. Look how much quicker you are, Jay, when you don't hit the dirt. Amazing, right? Had a better line through there than Richard. We managed to somehow stretch back half a second. Okay, Jay. Ten minutes to go. That's ten minutes left. Stay on it. This isn't over yet. He's all over you. Keep your exit speeds up. Stay smooth. Refuse to believe that, Jim. Calm yourself down. First race of the season, you're already drunk and giving me rubbish advice. It looks like Robert might have had a an instant, small instant of himself for of his. The gap to Dempsey. Of his own. Not point nine. Two point four. 
Well, just need it so Richard is focusing more on Emilio. Richard very quick through this bit though. I don't know if that's a Hyundai thing, but yes, this new bop. Friggin' A. Just done it. 158.39. New fastest lap for Nagi. 158.13. On one of the quicker sessions, or one of the earlier sessions. Just done it. 159.36. It was an all Audi domination. However, as the last few practice sessions I've seen, it is a lot closer now. So, I am, and everyone who's not an Elantra driver should be relieved to know it's looking good for us. We've had a horrible set of corners there. We are slowly getting away from Richard. Expect that distance to shrink a little bit, though, with the slipstream. <sighs> yeah, he's gaining. All right, Jay, that's half distance. Fuel levels are fine. <laughs> Better driver is eventually going to get me. The leader's just done a 158.25. I trust he's not going to dive. Your lap time was 159. Right side. Still there. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Clear right. Sector 1 is 0 0.46 off the pace. Sector 2 is 0 0.28 off the pace. Sector 3 is 0 0.6 off the pace. Kept a call. Kept a call. That's not going to be the first time that's going to happen. Don't be pressured. Keep your exit speeds up. I take different lines. I don't know if that's because I'm taking the incorrect lines or if it is possible to take different ones through certain corners of VIR. We had a bit of a better corner there than we did last lap. Okay, Jay. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. Oh, we've got Isaac catching up to us, though. Isaac has been bloody quick. The guy ahead is sharp. That lap was a 159.48. You're a second off in sector one. It. Just keep it smooth, Jay. Mm. 
Mark, I'll wait for a decent bit of the track to overtake. I'm not going to fire you. You're a lot quicker. Straight to the straight. Ooh, we'll see what happens. We're going to hold this position. Do right, you want to go down the inside now? Sharp. Ahead is now. So it just happened there? Ooh, I don't know. No, I just think he got a really mega exit through there, unfortunately for me. Oh man. Isaac is quick. Up seven positions. AJ, you've got half your fuel left. The gap to Martel behind is now 0.6. Very quick. I'm going to get absolutely wasted here. But Rich is going to use him to you've just done a try and open up a gap on me. He's going to have me, he's going to try here. Okay, Jay, you've got 10 minutes of fuel. Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. There's no way I'm going too wide on that corner. Fucking hell, defend these positions. I've still got Richard behind me, so I have to consolidate there. Consolidate, <laughs> concede. Audi, though, look at that. An Audi just absolutely being put through its paces. P5, one more lap to go. Good consistency, keep them coming. For a perfect opportunity on me now. It's not giving that, he's much closer to me than I am to Isaac. Isaac already pulled out seven tenths. Scary pace. Ooh, he took a bit of grass. Good exit out there. This is giving me a little bit of a lifeline. I'm slowly pulling away from Richard. I need the slightest amount though. Why is that makes any more mistakes?
Great race, so I'm very happy with a fifth. First race of the season. Man. Isaac was, uh. Yo, GG's. <laughs> just way too quick there. Richard Yellow kept flag. me on my toes, so. Conversal. I think we can undoubtedly call out a really, really good solid start to this season. Everyone raced really well. I, try, I managed to keep Richard away, but Isaac was just far too quick in that Audi. And if we go on the subject of the bop, Civic, Elantra, Elantra, Audi, Civic, Elantra for your top six. There wasn't too many uh, rosters to choose from in this split. And in the split below hand, there was still sort of bit more of a Hyundai sort of what's the word I'm looking for tribe but as the season will go on I think we will find that each car will have its strengths and weaknesses at certain tracks and with all these new TCR drivers coming in we should see a really nice variety of cars being chosen which is at the end of the day kind of what the majority of us really really want but an I rating change plus 33, safety rating going up a little bit, two splits this early in the day, this early in the week, so like I said, I'm absolutely thrilled with that one. If you still are on the fence about getting the touring cars, hopefully this race and hearing the opinions of others on Reddit, Discord, all that sort of stuff, hopefully that makes you bite the bullet, grab any of, any of them that you want and get out on that track and just have all the fun that you want. Thank you all so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you haven't already hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, check out the rest of the stuff that we've done through week 13 and before we have some videos on the Clio, the new Formula Ray which I do really want to jump back in very very soon, uh, check out the Twitch link underneath, my discord, League Racing with SRL, the Touring Car Discord, there's so much to check out underneath in the video description so please make sure that you do, but most importantly I will see you all next time so take care of yourselves and even more importantly take care of each other